hi guys it's february favorites time so just keep watching and you'll find out what i like this month so for makeup favorites this month i've had three things that i have been absolutely obsessed with one being this brand newish not that new but it's kind of new to me this is the australis fake eye palette it is gorgeous it is priceline so it's drugstore in australia this retails for about 24 dollars 15 shades matte shimmer metallics beautiful absolutely obsessed with it not wearing it today ironically never wear the actual favorites in a favorites video huh, I'm so silly but this is beautiful it comes with absolutely stunning match and matte and shimmer shades and uh, this is just what i've been going for pretty much a whole month of february i've been absolutely obsessed with this maybelline strobing stick in the color iridescent 100 stunning absolutely it's like perfect actually i am wearing this today I know it's coming up on camera, but I love it. It's stunning. It gives that beautiful, like, mirror finish to the face. And it's just amazing. It's drugstore, so it's super affordable. And usually I don't... Cat fur. Usually I don't like cream, like, stick formulas, because you want to apply them straight to your face. Thank you, cat. It's sort of like... You apply them straight to the face, and it sort of peels off the foundation and everything else you put on. But this one is, like... It's so velvety soft. It just goes on and you just pat it in with a beauty blender or your finger and it's just, it's there, it's stuck. It's beautiful, it doesn't take any of the coverage away from your foundation and I'm obsessed with this. Go buy it. My last makeup favorite is actually an oldie buddy goodie. This is the Maybelline Color Sensational Lipstick in the 55, oh sorry, 553 Glamorous Red and this is a beautiful, it is not red in my opinion. This is what I'm wearing on my lips today and this is not red at all. It is that beautiful like brown mauve colour that like it just makes you feel sophisticated. Not a little bit older but just like it makes you feel glamorous. And it is not matte, it's not too glossy. It's just that perfect satin finish which I've been after for ages. because it's, it's coming into like autumn now over here so it's cooling off. My lips are drying out and I just want a stunning shade. It's going to last but hydrate my skin lips as well and this is just the perfect lipstick next is up to skincare and this is probably like one of my favorite things at all at the moment my skin's been breaking out really badly i don't know what if it's hormonal or it's something else but i've had two masks that i have been absolutely obsessed with and i found they've really really helped the first one being the l'oreal paris uh pure clay mask this is in the red algae one this is for refining and helping with texture which is i have a lot of textural issues obviously where my skin's either like just gluggy or just feels really off and I've been using this about twice to three times a week which is probably a bit excessive but more more masks the merrier right mm -hmm. this is just great and it's pretty like it's quite affordable it's about 20 bucks which is good price I guess for a nice mask and the other mask that I've been obsessed with this is for my favorite mask out of all the ones I have at the moment this is the antipods it's upside down antipods manuka what's oh, coming up <laughs> Antipods Manuka Honey Mask. This is just amazing. The Manuka Honey hydrates, but like the Manuka Honey also kills all the bacteria that causes acne. So it's acne fighting, but it doesn't strip my skin. And my skin feels so beautiful and soft afterwards. I, I just obsessed with this mask. I'm pretty much using this every second night at the moment, just because I can. And But it's pretty expensive. It's about $40 Australian. Eh, but I'm still going to love it. Mwah. Moving on to my final but slightly random favourite this month, it is hair care, which I don't really talk about hair stuff very often, but this is the Batiste Instant Dry Shampoo. This is the sweet flavour, flavour? Hmm, you eat it, you try on me. This is the scent Sweetie, it is floral but youthful floral, it's not like grandma floral, and I don't really like the fact that it leaves a white cast in my hair, but you just know, you rub it in, you rub it out, it's all gone, it's all good. I love this smell. Smells so good. So good. Thank you so much for watching, guys. This is my being my February favourites of 2017. Just remember that this month, March, is my birthday month, which means I'm turning 21 years old, and that is scary as fruitcake for me. I'm getting old. It's just how it is. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification button too, so whenever I upload a new video, you'll find out. So I guess I'll see you on my next video.